What is our word today? Procrastinate. To emphasize how you can make procrastination go away, I want to tell you a story about Mason, an attorney who was in quicksand because of procrastination. My name is Pamela Deneuve, and I have worked with lawyers for over 25 years, and I help them to have the best law practices, the best lives that they deserve to have. So let me tell you a little bit about how Mason was in quicksand because of his procrastination. Mason felt like he had so much work to do, but he was so backlogged. And it actually resulted in him having physical symptoms. Some of those symptoms were he was having indigestion, he was having migraine headaches, and they went on and on, and he just could not stop having this anxiety, which actually kept him awake at night, thinking about deadlines, thinking about cases he had to do, and thinking about the things that he needed to have done. Thinking about the things that he needed to have done. Now, so one of the things that plagued Mason was perfectionism. And because he had imposter syndrome, he felt like he had to make everything absolutely perfect in order to prove himself and that he was a good and phenomenal lawyer. But this perfectionism had him take so long on cases and he actually would put off doing the work he needed to do on these cases because he'd rather check email, he'd rather have conversations with staff, he'd rather have talks with clients, but he did not want to get the work that needed to be done in order to prepare and to get uh, briefs and to get demands out. He just could not make the time. He could not just sit there and do those things. He would rather do email, be on the phone. So this distractions caused him to be overwhelmed and have more and more work and more and more deadlines that were looming. So we started to talk and then we just made a strategy. So the first thing we did was he made a to-do list. So that means he looked on his desk and everything that needed to be done. Then he prioritized it and then by deadlines. And anything that had deadlines, he put them in order of when they needed to be done. Now, when you have a deadline, the thing about it is that you have to prepare in advance. So we had to actually calendar the time in his calendar, in his schedule, so that he could prepare for these deadlines and meet them well ahead of time. And it was like he was got an elephant off of his chest. He felt so relieved. He felt like his life was in order. And the things that happened were, number one, he started to get a nightly routine. He got a morning routine, which is ultimately so important to have order in your day. His physical symptoms disappeared. He stopped having chest pains and indigestion. He stopped having migraines and he began to have a good night's sleep with some of the techniques that we were able to give him. So now Mason is on top of his law practice. He's getting the work done. He's feeling relieved. He's feeling excited about his day. But the thing that makes me most happy about Mason is that he was able to restore happiness and harmony and even romance in his marriage. You too can like look at what you need to do to stop the procrastination and get your to-do list and get things done. Thanks for watching. Please click the subscribe button and we can delete procrastination. Once we apply these strategies, we can ditch procrastinate.